The, black, uh, the battle over the Black Lives Matter mural in the historic Greenwood District continues. Today, members of the community rallied, sending a message to the mayor. Our two works for you's Vincent Hill is live in Greenwood. He has both sides of this very heated debate. Vincent. That's right, Mike. Members of the Greenwood community say the murals should remain. However, the mayor says if certain legal requirements are not met, it must go. How and why would we want this removed? Freeman Culver is the president of the Greenwood Chamber of Commerce. We know that black lives should matter. And in 1921, when they bombed our people right here on this historic ground. Black lives did not matter. He says he met with Mayor G.T. Bynum and wants the Black Lives Matter mural on Greenwood to remain, but says the mayor was not receptive. I don't understand why the mayor does not want to help us preserve this history. Others say the city's legal reason of not having a permit for the mural is an insult. Was it legal nearly 100 years ago when folks came down to Greenwood and dropped bombs, killing and looting? from innocent people, was that legal? Pastor Turner says Mayor Bynum is playing politics rather than embracing a social issue. And it's not just about a painting on the street. It is about the simple phrase that I hope the mayor can one day say, Black Lives Matter. Mayor Bynum says he's not against the message. I think it, it is a, a beautiful mural. The message is important, especially in this era but says the meeting went a different way, and he's tried to work with the Greenwood community. If they want the mural there, the options to keep it there remain at their disposal. The mayor said those options are for the city to vacate the street, meaning the city would not be responsible for maintaining it, or request a permit from the city council to keep the mural. The mayor says the Greenwood Chamber of Commerce decided against both. They felt that it was a, uh, that the message that's there is associated with a national political movement that not all people are on board with, and they did not think that it should be in the middle of a street. But Freeman Culver says the mayor is using the mural to bring division. This is something that the mayor of Tulsa is using to divide the black community. Now, I reached out to other businesses that the mayor says wanted the mural removed. I have not heard back as of yet. Also, there's no time frame on exactly when the mayor will have the city remove this. Now, coming up tonight at 6, what the bottom line is, what the mayor says, is the reason the mural must go. In Tulsa, Vincent Hill, two works for you.